You are not gonna believe what this couple did to their four-year-old kid. Guys, I made this video previously where I said this guy restored hope in humanity after he returned over fourteen thousand dollars that was mistakenly given to him as a gift. But uh, you see this particular story, it will make you question humanity. It will make you ask that question. Do people have conscience at all? Why am I saying this? Here is the story. Let me break it down to you. So one day. A 31 year old lady met a 26 year old man and uh, they fell in love with each other. <gasps> but the problem, the lady already has a kid with another man. So the boyfriend stepped into the stepfather room and uh, started becoming a stepfather. But uh, that's not his idea because the guy is still young. So how can a 26 year old take care of a 4 year old? But uh, let's keep going. So they started their life, they moved in together, everything was nice and smooth. The guy was working, everything was nice and smooth. So one day, the guy decided, you know what? Let me treat myself to a good uh, plasma TV. The guy spent his money, bought a plasma TV, set everything up. Now, the question is, how big is the plasma TV? We don't know. How small is the plasma TV? We don't know. What size is the plasma TV? We don't know. Oh, we know that he bought a plasma TV. So what happened? One day, the four-year-old kid of his girlfriend, was playing in the living room and you know kids sometimes they make you say one of the most offensive things you can think of but at the end of the day they are still kids so along the line of playing the four-year-old mistakenly broke the tv <gasps> and yo the 26 year old got pissed off like the guy was so angry to the extent that he and his 31 year old girlfriend on a life a four-year-old kid because of a broken plasma TV. What? Yes! You heard me right. They unalived a four-year-old kid because he broke a plasma TV. Now, that's not the weird part of this story. Let me tell you what the weird part is. After they were done killing the kid, they digged up a shallow grave and they buried the kid. So, months passed by, people started noticing, hey, what's wrong? This kid that always moves around, we don't see him anymore. So, the people of the community started asking questions hey where's your kid where's your kid and uh, the mom will always give excuses no he's with the dad oh my grandmother took him yeah, all kind of excuses so after one month two months people people started wondering no you can't say this kid is with your boyfriend but your boyfriend doesn't come here you can't say he's with you for how long so now in people's mind something was up but they can't pinpoint what was actually wrong so much question and uh, not seeing the kid for over a month remember this thing happened july of 2023 so after some months went by and they couldn't see the kid and they couldn't get a definite answer to what happened to the kid they decided to get the counselor involved upon the council hearing this everybody was involved to know what actually happened to the kid and uh, as luck might not be on their side the lady and the boyfriend was finally arrested to give proper answer to what happened to your four-year-old kid and along questioning them the letter found out the mother confessed that oh the boy broke a tv and we unalived him and buried him in a shallow grave now the question is how far would you go for matters of the earth you just wasted a life because of a plasma tv how do you think government should punish this parent remember the man is a 26 year old who is playing the step the rule of a stepfather but my problem is with the mother with the mother how much love will you have for a man you just met that you will team up with this guy to kill your own offspring this kid was in your stomach for nine months but you maimed this guy's life because you fell in love with a 26 year old guys i don't know how to judge this i just want you to take your time let me know what your thoughts are down below in the comment section because as i'm talking to you now i'm pissed off at the mom i'm pissed off at the father in fact i'm even pissed off at the tv but uh, like this video subscribe if this is your first time coming across my channel and i'll see you guys on the next video and uh, shout out to rustin beg northwest that's where the story happened so shout out to northwest bye bye